doing? We're making these slow cars fast. This one is called Jose. This is Jose. Custom manifolds. It's going to be a non intercooled twin turbo setup. I believe it's going to have a 418. We're not building the motor, just the turbo setup, but I believe it's going to have a 418. Six speed manual car. Should be interesting. They are twin 80 millimeter turbos, billet wheels. Car's going to run on E and eventually it's going to get put on methanol and that's when it'll really shine it's on the methanol but for now we're just building building the turbo kit getting everything mocked up that way we can change all the little things that we don't like or want to change we're trying to build it as equal as possible on both sides just really clean good looking but fully functional so far so good Well, you want to you want to cut this one, right? Yeah. Mm. Real nice. So, what's the cardboard trick? <laughs> so the the Vanjen flanges, you don't want them touching fully flush you want to have the, that way the pipe can move and articulate you can use use the ring as a template and press it down on some cardboard and then cut the cardboard out and put it in between the flanges while you mock everything up with the proper gap in between the two flanges so ideally the best place for this wastegate to go would be right after this bend in the bend straight so the air is going into the bend into the wastegate before it has to bend down or you know in any other similar spot like that the what you don't want to do is just find like a straight piece of pipe and go right into the side of it it's just not going to function hmm. it'll work to a certain extent and then it's it's going to end up over boosting because the flow isn't smooth into the wastegate Do do do, time to tune a fucking Honda. Do this, I'm committed. Yeah. What, you gonna have to start from scratch? Yeah, it's got a uh, read protection on it, so I can't read the base file off of it that it's currently running on. So when I flash it, there's no turning back. <laughs> read protect, yeah, it is turned on. I cannot read. It won't show me anything. Are you doing it? It's doing it. Yep. <laughs> oh, it's going backwards. Shit. How does it go backwards? <laughs> yep, going forward again. I can't remember exactly what we made. On a break in tune, I think we made like 480. 480? Hey, bud. It made over 600 before. Got a precision ball bearing 60, 67, 67. Ooh. Fully built K20. And that's all she rode. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> From scratch. I didn't have the injector spot on. They're a little bit bigger than what I put in there. Well, we started off with 650. I'm gonna try 850s. See how that does. 
it doesn't seem like it's getting close enough. I'll just pull them out and put them on the flow bench and find them, find out what size they are that way. Because there's no markings on the injector. They're not like an aftermarket set that would just have, you know, a label on them. Yeah, they look like a factory, almost like a factory GM injector. Well, uh, one of the boost controller lines on the solenoid blew off, so couldn't make past 17, so now, now it should make even more. level you was at? On 17 pounds, it's duty cycle is what, 60. Oh wow, so we still got plenty of room. Yeah. Need to need, put a new needs, spring in it. Needs, needs every spring. 12, 15 pounder. You ain't got one of them? This kid's probably got another box at his house, but. No, I don't run baby wastegates. <laughs> <laughs> run the big boys. Yeah. I will I will take one for the team. I will sacrifice myself. Oh, yep. He's over here. Boom! Oh! Yeah! Oh! Shine! 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 <laughs> shine! Shine! Okay. Where's he at? Uh, he's done. Like, <laughs> that is part of him. <laughs> Fuck. Goddamn yellow flies.